everybody. This is Cindy Utter. Welcome to my Artsy Endeavors. Have fun. Hey guys, Cindy Otter here with my RT Endeavors. Guess what? We have a grab and glue finished. Look at this. Love, love, love the goodness. It's nice and thick. Um, this is actually a journal. The journal that I'm, I worked in was a journal that Gina had sent to me quite a long time ago. And what I did is I started taking it with me every time I traveled and I would just work in it um, a little bit here and there. Um, oops, hold on. All right, sorry about that. Chase decided he wanted to do some uh, barking, and yeah, no, we don't do that on videos. So anyways, he's calmed down now. Um, like I said, this is a journal that Gina had made and sent to me a long time ago, so I just, I take it with me and I, I play in it. Um, this is actually an earring. It's a kitty cat. See it? It's just a little kitty cat that I just poked a hole here. And right there, you can see the back of the earring. See it right there? I just poked a hole and stuck it there. I thought it was cute. Anyways, we're going to do a quick flip through. Um, I'm not really going to go into detail about all the pages. I don't really think I need to. Um, but they're just fun. Just a lot of fun to sit back and play with and doodle. And um, some pages, you know, get more than others. Some are just whatever they happen to be. There's texture on them. Um, this one's done like on a plastic that I glued to this piece of cardboard. Watercolor rose. That was fun. This is a, a painting that Gina had done. Um, Love Life. There's a couple stamps I got when I was out on a vacation somewhere. Surrender. And just love. And a piece of painted paper. And again, this is something I've just slowly, as I've been on vacation, played with. This is off of packaging for something from Ranger. I'm not sure what. Um, but I really loved how this page came together. I thought it was really cool. So I really love that. This has got some, um, this is on deli paper, some uh, flowers that I had stamped on deli paper. This is one of Gina's um, uh, stamps that you got, or stencils that you guys will be seeing, I'm sure, soon. Just play around. Um, just having fun, celebrate each moment, light and peace. Just love you. That's actually a uh, Gina's face that's been copied. Um, keepsakes. Keepsakes. I <laughs> love this owl. It's so cute. Um, this page, I really love how it turned out. I love all the color. It's got some uh, texture on it right here from leftover texture paste. Um, I just, I really enjoy that page as well. <laughs> you never know what's going to happen. This guy's just this guy. Uh, love life. <laughs> this one says trust, and here's a little fish. Hopefully he's trusting this big bird not to eat him. Uh, again, this is a Gina um, face that was just um, put on here. This that you see in the background with the blue, that's actually um, the pamphlet for the creativation when I was out at CHA with Gina. We had a blast. It was so much fun. Crafting and Creativity, <laughs> Monday Man, Discover Desire and Dreams, Wish. I love these images. I'm not sure who sent them, and I really wish I knew because I'd love to get more of them. Um, they sent me, it's, it's a comic book, and it has all these really cool images. I think there's another one in here. I'm sure there is. I'll have to show it to you. Um, and I just love those images. I love those people. They're so cool. Um, soldier, this is um, scraps from again CHA. This is a Tim Holtz pamphlet with with uh, scraps that we used. This I just left clear. Apparently, I didn't want to do anything to it. Uh, fresh start with a 
cup of tea. This guy and his honey. I didn't really do anything more to him. I'm not sure why, but that was just, he's staying the way he is. Um, this little girl with her kitty cat. And again, some of these, like you see the paints here, um, as I'm working at my desk and I have leftover paints, I'll just swap it in some of these uh, grab and glue journals. And it just kind of gives it a, like an instant background. Memories, a shoe, keep in touch. Oh, here's another one of those characters from that um, comic book. Just says shrug. I love it. This was just uh, borders. We did a border swap in KIU a long time ago. Chaser? No. Chase? He's thinking about barking again, I can tell. Um, just a clock with a frame that I thought was really cool. Hmm. These guys I haven't done anything more to. Um, they're just fox people <laughs> with pumpkins. And, you know, right now um, I put a silver around them. But other than that, right now they're going to stay just the way they are. You never know. Down the road I may find something and say, oh, I've got to put it in that grab and glue. We'll, we'll see. But right now that's it's going to stay the way it is. Uh, this is the Tim Holtz paper dolls. Um, just some random fabric, some gauze, some lace, some trim, some buttons. This just playing around, drawing a face. Eh. Um, this one again, just playing. This is beautiful. Uh, these um, I actually cut out of a National Geographic. I just put the word two. No idea. That's just what it needed to be. <laughs> a little guy moment. Love his top hat. Perfect. This is a Mindy Lacefield image. Um, like I've told you guys before, I will actually take my Somerset Studios and art journal books and I'll cut out images that I really like and then I use them in, in this style of a book, the grab and glue, and it just says perfect. Got some textured paper here, some lace. Background again, that's from Tim Holtz on the CHA. And it just says perfect. Um, here's another one of those characters which I just really loved. This is actually an octopus, right? There's the some of the things. And I don't know, I just, we've got some raindrops here. I've got a little zebra here, a mouse. I, it just happens. <laughs> so I, I really enjoy it. Um, this is a little pocket. This is actually a tag that was in this um, journal when Gina sent it to me. And it says, imagine life. And she's got it embossed. This is really pretty. It's embossed, can you see that glare? Really pretty. So I left that tag in there and um, we worked on this again. More of those borders. Just a minute, Chase. Let the wind carry you. This is the back side of the envelope. This is, of course, this is a Diane Reevely, um, one of her girls. This is one of her first stamp sets, I believe. Everyone has a rainy day. Just some odds and ends, some washi tape, some. Whatever, just playing some paper, a few flowers. This one just says artistic. And this again, the background, just a minute. The background is from uh, Creativation or CHA. This my big guy. I think he wants to go to the ladies' men's room. Um, have a spot of tea. You know, just a tea bag and hey, little guy or girl drinking tea in her thermos and her cup. I, I don't know, just put it together. Um, this one here I remember doing out in CHA. Uh, Jean was actually on the phone and I just I started putting her together. This was just a piece that I cut out. Um, this was a flower, threw a head on there and some extra piece. And then I just did some journaling around it um, which was really cool. I had fun with that one. This one is just a spiral. It's all I wanted. I had thought my my idea was to take this page and finish it out with the black and white and I just Eh, I didn't want to do that, so here it is. This little guy I love. I love how this page turned out. Um, this is from Carol Minton. Uh, it's just a little piece of uh, canvas fabric that I stuck a button and a couple leaves on. Um, hello, let love grow. And I just love this little guy. I think he's so cute. Again, this came out of a uh, National Geographic. I just like these guys are kind of cool. And it just says visions. Nothing fancy. 
This is, um, the, the face is actually um, a stencil, I believe. And then this is Gina's new stencil, which is the arrow. So I played around with that. It says perfectly real. Uh, this one just says laughter. Again, just playing with images that I've cut out of magazines, pieces of book text, that kind of stuff. Um, these are a couple flowers that I made, which still have glue on the buttons, but that's okay. This was just a big bow that I stuck here, and then I put a little piece of fabric down and put this lady here and just a couple button flowers. This is a doodle that I did on the plane, um, coming in or going from somewhere probably CHA, and then this tag is in here, just says Cherish, nothing on the back. Back side of the envelope is just a tag, played around with some textures, some, um, that's actually a tablecloth, piece of a tablecloth, paper tablecloth. Out on a limb, Mr. Owl. I believe Ann Williamson sent this to me. I'm not positive, but I think that was Ann's that she sent to me a while back. And then the end, which says the creative journey continues. Dot, 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 dot. So here she is, big and beautiful and lovely, and I've had a blast with her. And believe it or not, I have another one that's actually in process. So, um... I believe this is the next one you'll be seeing. This is one that, let me back out a little bit, that I made um, just out of, these are file file things. These are great because they're nice and sturdy. Um, I've done a little bit in this. I've done a little bit of stamping, a little bit of collaging. These are like trash collages. Again, it's just got book paper, um, magazine paper, whatever happens to be in it. This is paper from, uh, uh, Somerset Studio, I believe. Again, another collage thing. This black paper is textured on this side. Um, some samples of different paper weights. Card that I had stamped. More paper weights. Another texture. Alright, so this is my next one that I'm going to be playing with, um, actually, and I just messed it up, but we'll fix that. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, as always, please, you know, like, comment, share, subscribe, and I will answer all comments, and we'll chat with you soon. Take care. Bye. Hey, everybody. I hope you enjoyed that video. As always, hit like, share, comment. I'll answer any of the comments that you have or questions. Um, and as always, be kind, have fun. That's what life's all about. And happy creating. We'll talk to you soon. Bye.